It's good y'all man we back for another video man so this is just some little b-roll i'm finna throw into the video this is not the purpose of the video i just came out here to look at some shit because i'm getting the oil change as y'all can see you know what i'm saying getting the oil change right now so i said fuck it why not come look at the cars and shit so they don't have nothing rt we don't we don't look at little boy shit another rt piece of shit scat pack a little more of what we talking now now we looking at something nice Alcatara seats. What they want for scat packs nowadays? They want they bid they bid sixty thousand dollars and this bitch a uh, twenty three. I see that they bid sixty bands and they want twenty three for it. It's a twenty three sixty bands. It's crazy. Imagine paying that much for a fucking scat for some slow shit. No ass. That shit dead. RT. They really don't got nothing out here. Like, Dodge is really flaming. This is the only scat pack they, have, they got out here. They had, like, four of them at first, but now they just got three RTs, one scat. They sold the other ones. But we're going to go look at these C8s, though. You know what I'm saying? C8s is cool. I fuck with C8s. They cool. They more of, like, an old nigga car, though. You feel me? It'd be hard right here. That bitch really, like, luxury as hell on the inside. It'd be decent, though. Real shit. So you know saying it's cool. Which one y'all taking? The gray one or the black one? I'm going black one. I'm going Batman. Oh, this is 2024, so I know they want a honey. Oh, they only want they only want 82 for it. The 24 though. It look like a 24. What's this one right here? Also another 24. This bitch, they want 75,000 for that. They want 84,000. What's the difference? Look the fucking same. And they got this red one. Red one cool. 2024. It be got red seat belts though. This really just some extra footage, man. Today we really doing a POV drive. And I'm gonna give y'all some updates on what's been going on and shit like that. So we ain't gonna do nothing too crazy today. This just some some little shit to throw in the vlog since I'm out here, man. Ain't really doing shit else. And these are all 2024s. Tell me which one y'all taking. Y'all taking red dude, white dude, gray, or black. Me personally, I'm going black. Because this bitch already Batmobile. So, I ain't never seen a gray one, though. This is my first time seeing a gray one. So, this bitch hard. But I fuck with this black one. Black one tough. But, yeah, they don't have nothing out here, bro. Like, they don't got no wide body scats. Nothing, like. You feel me? Obviously, they don't got no cats. That shit dead. You got to get used, bitch. You trying to see that? So, yeah, man. We just got RTs and scat packs, man. So this is some little B-roll shit, man. I'm going to turn y'all boys back on. We in the car. And we talking about some updates and what's going on in the city. You know what I'm saying? What's going on in the channel and shit like that. You feel me? So I'm going to get back with y'all boys in a minute. Let me show y'all boys something real quick. So I just got my oil changed, right? Look how much this shit is. $95, bro? Wow, man. Uh... Damn. I swear to God, bro. This shit was literally... Last time I came, it was like 70 some dollars. And he told me, oh, that's because we gave you a discount last time. Well, give me it again, bitch ass nigga. Not around here, partner. What the fuck? 95 is insane, bro. That's crazy, bro. This shit getting too expensive. What's good with y'all boys, man? Long time no see. You feel me? I know, I know. It been a minute since I uploaded. Now, look, as y'all see by the title, we will be doing a POV drive today. Obviously, I'm going to give y'all some pulls and, you know what I'm saying, some wine action and all that. You feel me? But this video is really for some updating purposes on what's going on with the channel and, uh, you know what I'm saying, and all that type of shit. So, yeah, let's get straight into that. You feel what I'm saying? So, y'all already know we're doing a series right now called Cat Hunting, right? We're looking for a wide-body cat, and it's been damn near impossible to find one. I ain't going to lie. It's been damn near impossible to find one, bro. I ain't going to lie. What I really should have did, the one y'all, the last car y'all seen was that Batman Hellcat. I should have just stepped on that shit, bro. And let me tell y'all why I should have stepped on it. Damn, my car wasn't tweaking all fucking week. Now I wouldn't tweak. Let me tell y'all something, bro. Matter of fact, let me kick this bitch in track. You know what I'm saying? So y'all have some entertainment, at least. You feel me? Ugh. I'm turning I'm turn traction off, too. You feel me? Because we're we going we gonna to get some good pulls in. You feel what I'm saying? But... I just want to update y'all so like so with the batman hellcat that was my last video cat hunting i think that was episode eight y'all already know by episode 10 11 i'm trying to have i'm trying to come new v you feel what i'm saying bro i should have just stepped on that 
cat while I had the chance, bro. And look, the reason why I say that is, there goes Scat right here. I ain't never seen him in the city before. He knew as hell. What the fuck? Let's see what he do. Let's see if he do something. My car wanna twig with me. He ain't on shit. He ain't on shit. That bit decent though, face up. Anyway. Bro, I should've just stepped on that Batman Hellcat, bro, because for one, it was cheap as hell. If, if I didn't tell y'all the price in that video, the car was only 43K, bro. He only wanted 43 bands for that bitch, bro. That's cheap as hell. 2019, 46,000 miles, right? But the reason why I didn't step on it was because of this, y'all. So I was talking to this dealer that's in Arizona. He was selling another cat, same thing, 2019. It was hard as, I'm talking about that bitch was so tough, bro. You feel me? And he wanted cheaper. He wanted, no, he wanted, I know I'm tripping. He wanted 45 for it, right? But it was harder. Like, it was way more worth it. It had intake, painted supercharger, fat ass cat head on the side. Just know it was way harder than the Batman one. Way harder, right? So, when I went down there, the, the fucking motive was to go down there, look at it, and just have it on the, you feel me, on standby just in case this red one don't go through, right? So, boom, I went and checked it out. A couple days later, you feel me? I check in, see what's up with the red cat, and he hit me up like, uh, yeah, uh, we decided to send it back because, because, um, the dealer was on some BS or some stuff. It was like they was taking too long to deliver it or something like that. Like, it was some technical difficulties or some shit, right? So I'm like, damn, they sent that bitch back. I'm mad as hell because that's the one I really wanted, you feel me? So, boom. I'm like, all right, so let me hit up dude with the, uh, Batman Hellcat. So I hit him up. He tell me, man, I'm sorry, but the car sold. Bro, come on with this shit, bro. You going slow as hell, my nigga. Like, bro, my guy, my guy. I want to speed around, but 12 be so deep around this bitch. I can't even tweak like that. But so I hit him up and he was like, bro, I sold it. So I'm pissed at this point. So I'm like, damn, I should have just stepped on that black Batman motherfucker. As soon as I had the chance, because it was cheap as hell, bro. Cheap as hell for a good at man, for a cheap as hell. And it was hard as hell. You feel me? Only thing he didn't have was an intake. That was literally the only thing he didn't have. The exhaust was loud as hell, tinny. It was just perfect. You feel what I'm saying? But I was mad as hell, so I stepped, tried to step on that and didn't get it because it's already sold, right? So that deferred me. So that put the cat hunting episodes on a slow, on a slow end. So let me tell y'all this too, though. Like, bro, it's so hard trying to get a wide body cat, bro. Like, damn. At this point, I'm gonna have to settle for less, bro. On some real shit, almost. Wreck, nigga. But anyway, at this point, bro, I'm gonna have to settle for less, bro, because it's so hard to find what I'm looking for. Cause y'all already know I'm looking for like a Pacific way and all that other shit, like a Pacific kind, certain specs to it, and all that type of shit, right? But it's really impossible to you. Know what I'm saying, man, fuck the ambulance, nigga. I don't give a fuck about that, nigga. But yeah, so it's, bro, it's like really damn near impossible to find the cat I'm looking for, like on some real shit, bro, like. I'm gonna have to settle for less, y'all. You feel me? And then every wide body cat is overpriced this shit. So I gotta get a rebuild title, motherfucker, if I'm trying to, you feel me? Get one for a good price. Because I already told y'all, like, I'm trying to get a cat to where I'm paying the lowest note, bro. I'm not trying to pay a band a month. That shit dead. You feel me? Because what I learned is anything over $57,000, you're gonna pay a $1,000 car note. You feel me? So I'm trying to find one under that, you feel me? So I can pay less. Like, what the fuck? Niggas ain't trying to pay high. Shit dead. So, I'm trying to pay less and shit, you feel me? But I can't find one, bro. It's hard, bro. Like, it's hard to find one, bro, for a good price. Like, all of them bought up because it's 2024. Y'all know they stopped making them. So, a lot of people is buying them up. It's not a lot out there on the market at all. So, it's, like, hard to find one. And then the ones I'm finding on Marketplace, decent. But they all rebuilt titles and shit. I'm looking for a clean title, dude. And to get a clean title is impossible. Any clean title, why body cat is like 65 bands max. Like it's like 65 bands is the lowest it got, and then anything up from there. I mean, I'm not trying to get on 2023 because that shit gonna be too expensive and all that other shit, right? So it's just I don't know, bro. It's just difficult. Let me turn traction off if I can, cause we ain't getting no stoplights. There we go. Demon time. Stupid ass. But yeah, bro. So it's just hard to find one, bro. Then another thing too, like credit, right? Cause y'all know y'all gotta have good credit to get these type of cars. Now, I have great credit, like, I have great credit, bro. I've been stacking my credit literally for this moment to get rid of this, you feel me, and upgrade, you know what I'm saying? Bro, that credit shit, if you don't got a good debt-to-income ratio, bro, 
that credit shit don't matter. You feel me? And let me break it out like this. Like, let's say like this, right? You could have a perfect credit score at an 850. If your debt to income ratio don't match the car that you're trying to get, they don't give a fuck. They not fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy. Like, let's say you making pay. Let's say you make a hundred k a year, but your credit score is like six fifty, right? Bro, they gonna fuck with you. <laughs> you gonna get that car? Cause they care about that debt to income ratio. So that credit score shit is like okay, cool. But at the same time, bro, they trying to see. They trying to see that debt to income ratio, bro. And then not to mention, y'all, I'm young, right? You feel me? So I'm young, right? So you feel me? I don't have a lot of credit history. So they also look at that. You feel me? So like, say if I was a 40-year-old man, obviously I'm going to have good credit history, right? So it's going to be easier for me to get approved for more shit because I've been having credit for a long time. So the fact that I'm young and don't have that much credit history, they not fucking with me off that neither. Like, damn, nigga. Like, I'm thinking all you got to do is build your credit score. You can get anything you want. No. Once you try to get a car that's over like 50K, they start looking in. Very, they start looking very technical about shit. Like everything is very technical after that. You feel me? Which is lame as hell, but it's like, it what it is, bro. You feel me? Bro, I'm seeing scats everywhere, bro. Look, another one. Scats everywhere around this motherfucker. But anyway, so it just, bro, it's just, it's just very difficult, bro. Like on some real shit. Like they care about that credit history shit and all that extra shit. And your debt to income ratio. So that credit score is cool. Yeah, they like that, but. You, your, your income gotta make sense, bro. And it's crazy, like, damn. And then, y'all probably like, bro, just trade your car in, this is the third. I'm gonna keep it 100 with y'all boys. Like, they not trying to give me a good enough, because I owe a lot, of, I'm gonna keep it 100. I owe a lot on this car, right? Because I wanted it so bad, it's an investment, right? They don't give up about that, bro. Like, they don't care about this car, bro. They not trying to give me no good pay for this car. So it's like, at the point is, I gotta just get the car and then sell this, you feel me? Cause that's the predicament I'm in. I gotta sell this bitch. I can't even, you feel me, trade this bitch in. And on some risk, y'all, I want a tracky, right? So let me tell y'all, let me tell y'all this story too, though, right? So I was finna get this track hawk. It was a red track hawk. Rebuild title, it was cheap as hell. He wanted 53 for that motherfucker, right? So I'm finna get it and shit. You know what I'm saying? But the dealer, he hating. He on some hating shit, right? I ain't even film this. It's like, it was a nigga that's like in Arizona, right? So he hating this shit. So let me tell y'all, my fault, I got carried away. But, um, y'all hear that woman that she got? I dang y'all fucking that. But no, let me tell you, let me tell this story, bro. I'm tweaking. So, okay, so it was this red track on hard as hell, intake, all type of shit, hard as fuck, right? Red guts, all that shit. So a dealer hating, right? So the car cost 53K, that's what we got listed as, right? This nigga put 10 bands worth of fees on the price. So when he went to add up the total and shit, bro, this nigga put 10 bands worth of fees. So the car ended up being like $65,000, bro. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? It was just 53. So I'm adding, I'm like, bro, you put $10,000 over fees, bro, on some hating shit. He like, bro, yeah, if you get a truck off, bro, you ain't paying no less than $1,200 a month, bro, because I pay $1,000 a month for my truck off. I'm like, so, nigga? Give a fuck? You probably got your ass dealt with, nigga. This bitch, a rebuild title is cheap as hell. Yo, I just put $10,000 worth of fucking fees. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you, my nigga? <laughs> But it's like, damn, bro, like, niggas don't try to see you win, bro. Because on some real shit, I want to get a um a trackie because the state I'm in, bro, the weather is bipolar as hell. Y'all already know it's going to be wintertime in no time. So it's like a track all got snow mode. It just be, per it's an SUV. It just be perfect for, like, the predicament that's going to come, come around, you feel me? But it's impossible. You better off trying to get a cat, charger, tally or something. Another fucking one. So y'all probably thinking like, bro, why don't you just get Challenger, bro? It's cheaper. Two door. No, bro. Two doors are ass, bro. I want a Charger. Like, you got to have four doors, bro. And Chargers just look better than me. Feel me? But at the point I'm in, bro, it look like I really got to settle for less because it's like, man, it's been stuck in a gear? Or am I tweaking? Like, it's like you got to settle for less because, like, bro, I'm trying to get this wide body with all this extra shit on there, bro. It's really impossible to find it. Like, I can't be picky at this point, bro. You feel me? But also, if y'all made it this far, like the video, bro. Like, like the video. I appreciate all y'all support. Like, you know what I'm saying? I rock with y'all heavy. You know what I'm saying? But it's just been crazy. Cause it's like, damn, like, 
it's hard to get this type of car, bro. It's not easy to get a wide body cat, bro. Like, damn, some bullshit, bro. For me. Also, I want to tell this too. So, y'all know how I've been kind of like vacant from this channel because I've been trying to, you feel me, do other shit. Now, um, don't get it fucked up. Yes, sliding corners. That video is still coming up. I just been lazy. I just haven't felt like doing it because I'm so ready to be in some new shit, bro. Like, I'm trying to be in some new geek shit, bro. You feel me? Like, I'm. I got a hard car. Don't get me wrong. This bitch tough as hell. I fuck with it heavy. Like I fuck with this car heavy. This bitch tough as hell, right? But I'm just ready for some new fast shit. Like I'm ready for some geek shit, bro. I'm just so ready for some new shit, bro. That I haven't had motivation to want to go film with this car for real. So I still gotta do slide in the corners, in the trenches. I still gotta do a video. Feel me? That's still coming, y'all. Don't worry. That's a banger. It's still coming. But I just haven't had motivation to just go get that video done because it's like, you know what I'm saying? I'm just ready for some new shit. I've been trying to get this new shit and it just been failing. Like, shit behind closed, shit behind closed doors, off camera, just been failing. So it's just like, bro, it's hard to go get that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? So, but that video's still coming. Um, and it's some shit I still gotta do to this car. Also, like, it's some I gotta get rotor steel shocks. It's a lot of shit I gotta get to this car. So it's like. That's videos that's coming too, but it's like I'm just giving y'all an update of like why the series has stopped or why I haven't been consistent with the series. So it's so much. And also, I started a reaction channel. So if y'all want to see me behind the car scene, behind this, you know what I'm saying? Behind the car, I've been doing reactions. So I'm going to pop it up somewhere on the screen. You feel me? Reaction channel is called That's Crazy Work TV. And I've been just doing reactions over there. And I'm uploading every day over there, like every day. So it's an everyday schedule over there. Over here, this is my content channel. So it's like I want to post bangers and well thought out videos so that's why the videos over here gonna be is consistent reactions is easy as hell you can just you feel me record some shit da -da -da, say what you gotta say and just do it you feel me real easy shit so if y'all want to see me every day content every day go to my reaction channel that's where i'm at you feel me but as of right now this is my channel that i'm trying to do mainly just content purposes on you feel me and turn this channel up for sure that's really what's been going on bro i just want to get y'all some info on how shit been where i've been at because y'all know bro like I'm trying to get some new shit. Damn, I'm bank slapping. I'm trying to get some new shit, man. I'm sick of having the same car, man. I'm ready to just upgrade. Because by October, it be it will be I had this car for two years. You feel me? I'm trying to upgrade. You feel me? I'm trying to upgrade every two years. Up that grand new whip. But it's like, it's hard, my nigga. Like, if you not making hella paper, they not approving you for shit. You feel what I'm saying? I prove you some shit. But then also, man, it's like the right way of doing things is to do this, right? So everybody know if you want a low interest rate, and your interest rate determines your monthly payment and shit and your term and all that, right? So if y'all didn't know, the right way to really go get a car is to go outdoor finance, right? Because you can get a cheaper interest rate at a credit union. Do not try a bank. Only credit unions. Do not go to a bank, bro. Only credit unions, you feel me? So if you go to a credit union, man. And try to get you a car, you'll get a lower interest rate, right? So I tried that twice, right? Bro, it's like when you try to do the right way of shit, it's harder. Like I'm trying to do it the right way, get a low interest rate, all this other shit. And that's even harder to get approved for than just going through a dealership. So it's like if you really want to just get a car and just get approved for real, bro, you gotta go through the dealership. And you know they're gonna hit your ass with a crazy interest rate, you feel me? So it's like I'm trying to do the right thing, but it's damn near impossible. I'm talking about I try Elga, Door Federal some off-brand fucking credit unions all type of shit bro like they all on some bullshit bro like and that's the right way to get a car too because you're gonna have a lowest interest rate and you're gonna have more protection on your car if you do it that way see a motherfucker Ugh, stupid ass but it's bro it's not as easy as y'all think i'm gonna keep it 100 with y'all boys right now but i ain't trying to make this video too long for y'all i just want to do like a quick pov man give y'all some pulls and shit and uh tell y'all what's going on and etc you feel me so i'm probably gonna get a, get a thumbnail somewhere type shit you feel what I'm saying? Hope y'all boys enjoy, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned, bro. We got more videos on the way. Like I said, if y'all want to see me on an everyday basis, go to my reaction channel. You feel me? That's Crazy Work TV. Um, We got some bangers coming, bro. Like I said, sliding corners. I'm going to do that video. I just haven't did it because you feel me? A nigga been busy and low-key and just haven't felt like doing it. Like, I'm just so ready to get a new car that I haven't felt like doing it. But, yeah, man. We got the car wash. We get to be washed up. Take a good-ass thumbnail for y'all boys. And, yeah. I appreciate all y'all, man. Thank y'all for all the support. You feel me? Like, the comments, subscriptions. Like, 
Thank y'all for subscribing on some real shit, bro. I appreciate y'all boys, but I'm gonna go ahead and get this car wash, man. And I'm gonna uh, give it to y'all boys in the next vid on the guys, bro. Oh, yeah, another thing, like, y'all, don't get it messed up. Like, this car is beautiful. Like, you feel what I'm saying? Like, she look good. You feel what I'm saying? She look great. I got to clean the rims. The rims dirty as shit. But she look great. You feel what I'm saying? But it's just, I'm just ready for some new shit. I'm ready for some geek shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, big body shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm just ready for some, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? But, yeah, y'all. So, I'm definitely going to keep y'all updated. Cat season, cat hunting is not over with. We're definitely still filming the episodes, but they might be on like a little hole for right now. So we probably gonna upload two other like type bangers and then get right back to it. Cause just know by November, we for sure gonna be on some new shit by November, 100%. But I ain't gonna lie. I've been trying like a motherfucker recently. I ain't gonna lie. And then this happened to you all. Like, look, my light foggy, my nigga. Like how did, hey, can somebody explain in the comments how this happened? How does this happen? I don't have no leaks or nothing. I don't know why this happened, bro. And then it's crazy because like y'all see this light right this light is clear but the light strip is dim this light has fog in it it's wet but the light is brighter makes no sense i don't know why the fucked up light is brighter than the good light like this bitch dim as hell that bitch bright as hell so it's like that's another reason i gotta you gotta go you have to go my nigga like what the f it's really hard to get a wide body cat, bro. Right now it is, cause y'all already know, like these bitches all bought up and shit like that. But <sighs> just crazy, bro. Like I'm definitely keep y'all boys updated. I just want to give y'all like a little walk around and shit like that after the car wash and shit. It look good. I'm trying to give me like a little dummy. Y'all a couple of revs, bro. I don't even. You know what's crazy? I don't even rev this bitch. And this bitch in a tunnel, so this bitch gonna be dumb loud. Like this <laughs> bitch gonna be loud as shit. Are y'all boys ready? Let me see. This bitch finna be dumb loud. Watch it be quiet and shit. Low key is dumb loud. I didn't learn how to rev like uh Lynn and Nick though. They be doing some shit to where they be hitting it and that bitch get the tweaking. I don't know what they be doing, but hope y'all boys enjoy it, man. Finna get y'all a little good little thumbnail and catch y'all in the next video for real. You know what I'm saying? Yo.